Good morning, my friends. Today is Monday, October 10th, and this is uh, Indigenous Peoples Day in the United States, uh, formerly uh, called Columbus Day. And I hope we can take uh, a few minutes at least today uh, and think about why we have made that change. I want to give you two Bible verses and a quote this morning. Yesterday, on, on Sunday, we talked a little bit about uh, how we could think more about God in our daily lives, how we could put God uh, front and center in our lives every day. Whether we're happy, whether we're sad, whatever the circumstance, God is there. So the first quote comes from a uh, letter to the Philippians, the, the greeting that Paul often gives to people where he says, when I think of you, I think of God. When I pray, when I pray for you, I give praise to God. The second quote comes from Psalm 27. It's also part of Psalm 23 that says, I shall dwell in the house of the Lord and look upon the face of God forever and ever. The first one from Philippians, I, I think can be very helpful because it not only says when we pray to God, we think of God, it's when we pray for others. When I pray for you and you pray for me, our mind can go directly toward God. The one from the Psalms uh, is, is a promise that if we can do these things and follow God's uh, will and love all people as God loves us, then we will dwell in the house of the Lord forever and ever. The quote I want to share is one I found last week. I don't remember um, who it is from, but it says, when you think of God so much, you can forget about yourself. That one might take a little bit of thinking to get the real point behind it. When you think of God so much, you can forget about yourself. There's another saying that I've picked up along the way that asks God to relieve me of my bondage of self. I don't think the, I don't think what we're being asked to do here is to uh, denigrate ourselves or you know think badly of ourselves, uh, but to think of God so much that we become incorporated in God and then God uh, becomes all of us quite a challenge. So I ask that as we go into this uh, coming week, we, we pray for one another, we think of God as often as we can, and we thank God for each other. Peace to you.